Hello everyone. Diwali is just around the corner and I have decided to make a special video for you. These videos are divided into two parts. First one is focusing on the large cap and second one is all about mid and small cap stocks. And for every video, there is some special mentions. Please remember that these stocks I discuss or my opinions. I was already invested in these stocks. Apart from the special mention, I am seeing closely to buy the special mentions also. And it's crucial to conduct your research before making any investment decision. This is only for the educational purpose and not intended to give any recommendations. Let's start the video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. The first stock is Bajaj Finance and excellent to consider with the PE ratio of 35 points. It has a very strong fundamentals and technical pattern. I will create a separate video to provide you more details about these Bajaj Finance. The target price is 10,700 offering a potential gain of 43.4 percentage. The second stock is HDFC Bank. Despite my continuous praise for its excellent fundamentals, there are some issues due to merger of HDFC and HDFC Bank. I already created a separate video addressing this. So please go and check it out. The target price of the HDFC Bank is 2150 offering a whooping gain of 45%. The next bank is ICIC. Similar to HDFC Bank, it faces a challenges due to the issues related US, the inflation going up, the interest rate hikes and many more. The target price of the HDFC Bank is 1,100 with a potential gain of 26.07%. Hindustan Unilever. As you know, I was providing you with a very high beta portfolio. This stock can help you to stabilize a high beta portfolio. It has a very strong fundamentals and has shown limited movement in the recent years, potentially or offering more than 20% of return. I cannot say where may it get, but there will be a more than 20% of return. The next stock is Kotak Mahindra Bank. Much like HDFC and ICICI Bank, I have already created a separate video discussing about it. Please find the link in the i button. The next stock is SBA cards. With the increasing demands for credit card and loans, SBA cards can be promising investment. While, while I don't have a specific target price as of now, a 55% gain could be possible. The seventh stock is SBA. State Bank of India has a PSU bank trading below its PE ratio. SBA is an attractive option with a target gain of 22.41% that is at 580 rupees. The next one is IDBs. I discussed this in a previous video. Check in iCard for more information. I, the target price is about 20% from now. The next stock I am discussing, the ninth stock is Reliance Industries. I have already created a video on this stock. You can go and check it out for more information. The target price of this stock is somewhere around 2008-20, offering a 20.62% potential gain. The 10th stock I was mentioning is Asian Bins. Once global issues like Ukraine war and uh, Gaza war subside, this stock is expected to rally with a target price of 3500 my special mentions including HDFC Bank with a current price of 619.85 and a target price of 700. It offers a 12.54% potential gain. The next stock is Tata Motors priced at 643.95 with a target price of 925. It could be yield a 944.08% gain. The 13th stock is Dr. Reddy's currently trading at 5443.10 and targeting of 7150. It has a potential gain of 30.78%. Please review and conduct your own research before making any investment decision. And remember, this is for educational purpose only. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more in-depth videos 
and each of these stocks.